To use the loop item inside of Elementor, the first thing you need to make sure that you do have Elementor and Elementor Pro installed and you already have some products listed on your WordPress installation. Then what you need to do is scroll down to where you see templates and you're looking for the theme builder. Once the theme builder opens, what you're looking for is this item right here called loop item. You want to go ahead and create a new one. I've already created mine, so I'm just going to open up this one. Once it opens, you will see a small little box and all it is is just you creating the one singular card. You're going to create and design the style of how it will look across the entire loop grid. Then you need to have a page created that you want the loop grid to actually sit on. So in this case, in most cases, it'll say shop. So you will be putting a loop grid like this on your shop page. So go to your shop page, open it with Elementor. Once it opens, all you need to do is go over to the widgets tab, type in loop. You're looking for loop grid and just drop it in. Once you drop it in, all you have to do from there is just choose the template. So with the loop item that we just created in the previous step, I titled my shop page loop grid. So you just need to choose that template. And then there you go. There is our exact um, loop item style that I just showed you in the previous step. It's now right here for our product grid. And that's pretty much it. That is how you use the loop grid inside of Elementor. And I also, in my latest video, showed you guys how to do it with the loop carousel as well. Go ahead and check out that video right here.